Viral Science, the home of creativity. Hey friends, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you how to make colorful patterns with NeoPixel LED strip and AT Tiny 85 microcontroller. You can also make this project with any Arduino board. So let's get started with this video. So to make this project you will need an AT Tiny 85 microcontroller, a push button, 16 MHz crystal oscillator, this is WS2812B NeoPixel LED strip, an Arduino board to program our AT Tiny 85, and this 5V connector USB connector. So this is the circuit diagram if you make this project with any Arduino board. But I will be using AT Tiny 85 microcontroller because it is very small in size. So follow this circuit diagram if you are also using AT Tiny 85 microcontroller. So to program this AT Tiny 85 microcontroller, we need to connect it with Arduino Uno. To simplify this process, I have designed my own PCB, so we can directly connect this PCB to our Arduino Uno board. So I have designed this PCB and generated the giveaway file. And now we'll place the PCB order at jlcpcb.com. We'll click on quote now and we'll add our giveaway files on this page. After adding the giveaway files, select the quantity, color of your PCBs and place the order. In 7 to 8 days I received my order. The PCBs were nicely packed and the quality of the PCB was very good. So now we'll connect all the components to our PCB board and we'll start soldering it. So after soldering, we'll connect our AT Tiny 85 microcontroller on the PCB board. Before programming, we'll remove this PCB board from the Arduino Uno and connect it to our computer. Now open the code. Pin 2 is defined for the LED strip and over here you can define how many LEDs are there in your strip. In my case, there are 40 LEDs. So first we'll go to examples and select Arduino ISP. We'll upload this code to our Arduino Uno board first. Select the board, select the port, Arduino is ISP and upload the code. After uploading the code, we'll connect the PCB of our AT Tiny or the Arduino Uno board. Now open our code, select the board that is AT Tiny 85. Select external 16 MHz crystal oscillator, select the port, select Arduino ISP and click on burn boot loader. After it's done, click on upload button and it will upload the code to AT Tiny 85. I have used this very small piece of PCB board and assembled all the components over it and soldered it according to our circuit diagram. So we just have to connect the power supply and the LED strip to this. So first we'll connect our programmed AT Tiny 85 to this. Then we'll connect the power supply. We'll be using 5 volts. And then we'll connect the LED strip. And our project is ready. 
So after connecting the 5V power, the LED will start showing its beautiful patterns. So friends, I hope you like this project then do hit that like button, share this video with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos and I will see you in the next one. Do subscribe and press bell icon to get instant notification for new video.